Hey guys, so in the last lesson we learned how to uh, change uh, from one directory into the, uh, into the other uh, using the CD, change directory, and we also learned dot dot takes us back a step. Alright, so in this uh, lesson we are going to uh, change directory into our desktop, okay, and then we're going to learn how to uh, create directories. Okay, so to create a directory, we say make directory, M-K-D-I-R. And then we we'll give it the name of the directory that we want to create. So in this case, we're going to create a directory called songs. So hit the enter button and this will create a directory. And for me, it is this directory that was created. All right, so now we can uh, go ahead and uh, change into that directory by saying CD songs. So this will take us into uh, that songs directory. Um, we can say open dot and it will open it up and we can see the songs directories here and there's no folders inside it. Um, we can make a directory inside it since we're already in it by saying make directory list and this will create a list directory. Okay, we can uh, navigate up with our arrow and open dots and we can see songs and we can see list directory inside the, the songs and of course you can double click this and it gives you the same view all right so um, something else that we want uh, to be able to to do is to cd into our list or we could print the working directory or we could see that we are all the way uh, from users into list but i want us to navigate back into desktop uh, cd dot dot will take us uh, from list into songs to go further back we say forward slash and then another dot dot so this will take us from list into songs into our desktop okay so if we hit enter and then we say print our working directory we can see that we've come into the desktop all right so this is um, how to navigate one level beyond so in our desktop, I'm going to create a directory called outer, but I also want to create another directory inside it called inner, all at the same time. If you hit enter at this point, you will have an error, okay, because it's looking for an outer folder, which doesn't yet exist, whilst trying to create an inner folder first. All right, so we want to get rid of this error message. To do that, you can say mk directory, you pass a dash p, so that's the a flag. Then you say outer forward slash inner. And then when you hit the enter button, you should have a folder called outer on your machine. All right, so I'm going to seed into that outer folder and then into inner folder all at the same time and print working directory. And we can see uh, that we are indeed in outer and inner. All right, so of course we could use our up arrows to find open dots and we can open it up using the terminal without having to click on the folder. So that uh, covers how to create directories uh, using our terminal application. We are going to use this terminal application a lot uh, when we start running our Rails um, commands. All right guys, so that's it for this lesson. I will see you in the next lesson.